Not that, George, you don't know the same. You I do. don't know nothing. Stop it. I just uh, rock and fire, rock and fire. Let's see what she's going to do here. She might be. Well, Robin is going to cut this ball in the corner, come down here and have a shot on the 12. And that's about the only shot she's going to have. They dig themselves into a hole yeah, here, though. Are. They are. They got that one ball by that eight you know deuce. What? That's going to present quite the problem. Well, you know what? If he could possibly stop the cue ball where the 12 is at, he could spin the 10 in and go into those balls. She could spin the 10 in because it will be her shot. Oh, yeah. That, never, never mind. That's a tough shot. That's a tough it shot. It takes but a good yeah, player. She, I mean, she's not that try she, it. No, it would take, a, it, it would it take an a experienced player to do that. player to do that. And she's got her skills. I mean, she's oh. looking at uh, yeah. right around a 400 Fargo. Probably gave her a, a 425 starter rating. She only has 37 games robustness. Well, he has only 63 games robustness, so they're awfully new to Fargo. In fact, they were talking about one of their buddies sitting down behind there, right over the Omega sign. They were talking about Look at uh, this shot. Boy, that was a <laughs> nice shot. Look at that. Man, he hit that ball per per beautiful. You see what he did? Mm -hmm. Two rails and come out like that. And he, he left the cue ball perfect. To open he got up that perfect 12. for her yeah. to come sure. with those balls. I sure. A little bit of left she shoot, Watch her. I hope she don't shoot just too easy because she's been shooting real, real easy. Real easy, real soft. Yeah. Yeah. If she hits this cue ball, she can go right in them balls. Well, their buddy Arnold is sitting right there in the blue shirt there. You see in the background? Well, he's looking to change affiliations. See, Oh, they could, she can make the, can make this in the goes. side. It goes in the side. It goes. Nice shot. And the eight goes on the other side, yeah. I think. They've got a yeah. league. they got a league over there in um, in Lakewood, and they want to move it over to BCA. So we're going to get Ozzy to go over and talk to them and get one of our uh, our general manager for BCA and see if we can't uh, provide the information he's looking for to to start their own BCA league there. And nice. Uh, Ooh, I well. thought he made that ball. Wow, that's close. Excuse me for a second. I think I'm gonna go off. <coughs> this dry air in the air conditioning is playing havoc with my throat, guys. So you'll have to excuse me when I cough every once in a while. My apologies beforehand. I'm trying to get away from the mic. Meanwhile, back at the ranch, Kara's going to shoot this bank, this uh, seven ball to the lower right hand, lower right hand corner pocket. No, she's not. She's going to play safe on the fifteen. Good shot. Cause they're going to shoot that. They want to shoot that four next. Mm -hmm. I know that if he don't hit it. Well, Robin's shooting, so she's probably going to kick this softly. Kicking me softly with the cue ball. Kick the short rail down here on the bottom. Mm, too much of an angle, huh? Yeah, she'd have to. Yeah, it's, just, it's a little tough. Well, what she's looking at over there. It would take a, yeah, it's not much. It would take a heck of a shot. Can she go two rails at it? She can go two rails. She can go two rails to the side rail, off the head rail with a little bit of right spin on the cue ball and come by the side pocket, between the side pocket and the six, and have a chance of hitting this uh, uh, this 11 ball. It's a tough, tough shot, and there's not much room. And they got to spin off that. It's, it's there. It's there. A little right English on that cue ball hit just past the point on the side pocket, and it comes over just below the side pocket. He's calling it. And that's exactly what she's playing. Oh, she's going to try to spin over with let, with with English. You need a lot of English, a lot more than that. And you got to go further over, or you'll hit the one. Oh, that looks good. That looks better. She won't hit the seven. She's going to scratch. And whether it scratches or not, they would have had ball in hand. 
Well, this brings Mr. Lane up. Daryl Lane from Antioch, Tennessee. Better shoot the four. Playing out of J-O-B's. Better shoot the four, sir. Shoot the four first, he says. Yes, I, I like that. Shoot the four, then those two balls there, then, oh, my, my. Ouch. I think he was looking at where he was going instead of where he was at. This ball here is easy, pretty easy. Yeah, he might make this. It kicks right off the mm -hmm. end rail. Mm -hmm. If he makes this, that cue ball just might slide past the deuce, though, and hook him. And it could just stay there, too. If he hits rail first, it stays there perfect. Uh, it all depends on exactly how it ends up contacting the 11 ball. Well, Mike's kicking at this ball. That corner of the side pocket is so big. It sticks out about an inch and a half. Most of the shots you shoot from here like this, it catches. He hit this ball almost. He hit it perfect. But see, he slid past the deuce and got, got hooked. Had he hit the rail first uh, you know, and make the ball, he would have hit the deuce. Otherwise, he was going to slide by there, and he did. Can she? She can't cut it. She'd scratch in the corner. But she can kick it. She can kick cross side. She might be able to cut this ball to the corner pocket. I think she has a shot. I can't tell by the monitor, but you know something? I can tell by looking at the table, and uh, nope. Looking at the table looks like no. So you just kind of kick at kick it, at it side? Yeah, kick at it for the sides. all you got. How about kicking it at two rails, going between the three and the seven and going two rails at it? No, nope. the, the angle coming through there is very, very, it's natural. And probably able to see the angle going through the three seven. You keep, no, you, you right I know, that's what, yeah, two. exactly. I don't. Yeah, you don't like that shot. She don't like it. She don't want. She, yeah, she don't like it. And that's all it takes. If she doesn't like it, it's right. the wrong shot. Let's see what they decide to shoot here. More than likely, just the. One rail cross, uh, kick. Go to the left side and back at the eight ball. She called it where? She pointed. She's going to try to cut this in the side pocket. No, she's going for the corner. I guess she can see it. She might go right into the side pocket here and scratch. Oh, let's hope not. She won't lose the game as long as she doesn't make the eight if she scratches. Oh, she, uh, that could have gone off the six, but it didn't. And now, the one good thing about their opponents having seven balls on the table and they only have the eight, the one good thing about it, it's out in the open. The eight ball's out in the open with not a, every ball is two feet away. And that's that four ball I wanted them to shoot first. Yeah, and that's gonna, it, it's going to haunt them. I know. It's it. going to haunt them. You called it. That's their trouble ball. Everything it else is. is out in the open. And that's they, they got one be a pocket, ball. and it's going to be hard to get on. Oh, Karish firing the six ball right into the corner. She hit dead center of the pocket. Leaves she's a straight a, in shot she's on about, the five. She's plays pretty fair. Mm -hmm. Tall drink of water. Tall drink of water. They seem very personable when I was out there talking to both couples, actually, or both both uh, both teams. Oh, they're from they're from Tennessee. Where are they? We friendly from there? Yeah, they were they were they were both very nice. I actually I didn't talk to Daryl. He got there after the fact.
Well, we got quite a few people watching. Yeah, we they've got they, they've got their uh, their uh, cheering section with them. They brought their cheering section with them. There's quite a few. Yeah, we've got what 15, 20 people watching them. This is a semifinal match. The winner moves on to meet uh, Ed Sinchai, Sinchai and Olga Arazova. Azarova. Olga me. Agaboga. No, it's Azarova. A Z A R O V A. <laughs> Azarova. I didn't look at that Z down there when I. Meanwhile, now look. Now look at the trouble they're in. They got a tough shot on this one ball, and position on the four ball. Uh, is there next in the world of trouble possible. here. Unless he banks it. That's not a bad shot. Just bank this to the lower left-hand corner and stop the cue ball right there. Stop your rock. And hope it doesn't go. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Well, it, you, you got to have some kind of a shot on the four ball. And yeah, but I wouldn't like to wouldn't want to be shooting that. Well, in that case, you just might as well roll it up in front of the pocket and leave the cue ball on the head rail. And leave a low percentage shot, just like he just did. And he's actually blocked the bank with the one. That's a productive one ball, sir. Now, let's see if Mike can just hit that eight ball real soft and hook him, use it to hook him on the rail. Can you hit the ball? You can hit that ball that soft. I right? think so, yeah. It takes quite a touch. It takes quite the touch. He's looking to kick. He could, he could if he goes rail, uh, he could kick, the, kick it in to win. Kick but it in what hole? In the corner, left-hand corner pocket up on top. Well, the right-hand corner for us. We talking about where? Right on the left-hand upper corner pocket. Kick it off of here into the rail and into the ball. Oh, quit you seeing them kind of shots. How's he going to do that? Well, they're next to impossible, but there's a shot. I know, but he's going to hit the one. I mean, oh, he can't make that no, ball. It's, it's back to those hero shots. Come on. We've seen a couple of them on here, and gosh, they look I know. good. It's open for that kick shot is what I'm he saying. He should just. I think he should play safe against the uh, there up on top. There you go. There you go. I totally agree. But, you know, you got to do one or the other. But they might find a third choice. The third choice might be to cut the cut the eight ball down and leave the cue ball where it's at. Exactly. Again. That's what I would yeah. do. Mm -hmm. Try to bank it out of there. Yeah. Put it in the middle of the, between the side pockets. Leave the cue ball go, straight across. Yeah, exactly go. from the one. That would be the best shot. Yeah. But he's got choices. I'm just trying to throw out some options. <clears throat> some of my options are pretty outlandish, but I'm just trying to throw out some options. He's prob He might just be trying to roll up, you know, like you said, to start the with. The touch shot. The That's what he's doing. And, uh, well, he's given them a shot that can beat them because they can make that. She makes that one ball. Um, well, the eight ball is still my play. If she hits center ball, she might pop against the rail and yeah. go into yep. the eight, yep. you know, just knock the eight away from and the rail a little and bit. And they're going to have a really good shot on the on the four yeah. ball. That's why I, I kind of said she's given them a shot that can beat them. They don't have to do much to get position. It's going to be one natural. thing. Bet she fire. I bet she makes it. She shoots good. I, uh, I'm, I'm going to go with you. I'm going to. I'm not going to bet against her. She's lined up. Sure. She's li she lines up good. She might need to cut a little bit more. Can't tell. But no, she hit it. Look. Oh, no, she needs close to cut enough. a little bit more. Close enough. But see, the position on the four ball was yeah. was pretty natural. And uh, had she pocketed that ball, things might have looked really good. For Team Tennessee, Team Tennessee and Team California, Team California in the black. I just made that up because they're from California. The other teams from Tennessee. These guys are from the Long Beach area, Lakewood. They play out of Lakewood Family Billiards. I've never been there. Have you been there? No, I haven't either. I bet it's a nice pool hall. And uh oh, here we go. She's cutting this ball back. In two to one, two 
two to one. They're on the hill, and Lane here, Daryl here is not. But they're going to fight to get on there. I can guarantee you that. She said, they said, we have fought and fought and fought, and we're going to continue to fight because we want to be in the finals. We want that shot at the $1,700. First place money for the 162 entrants. That's 162 Scotch doubles teams. You know, that's 300. What's 162 times two? A lot. It's 324 people in that event, in that division. That's a lot of peoples. From all over the country, here at the 2017 BCAPL National Championship, sponsored by Omega Billiards, Cyclop Balls, Predator Chalk, Diamond Pool Products, Viking Cues, Kamui. They have a nice, real nice Kamui, clear Kamui uh, booth. bridge. Bridge. They got a great booth. Um, and if you're at that booth, you might even find some guy named Robert LeBlanc selling his book. There. I might be sneaking around over right. there. You might be sneaking around over Somewhere. there. Somewhere. Trying to get a Coke. And this. He breaks, he breaks some good. There goes the, I thought the limbo was going in, but it didn't. 2017. Nothing. Oh, boy. There's another mess. Championships are proudly presented by Q Sports International. This is another mess. Another mess. He clumps the balls in the middle, up on top, in the lower left. The groups of balls just don't make it easy to run out, does I it? I thought they were calling my name again on the latch speaker. I was ready to jump and run over there. <laughs> I won a raffle yesterday, and I, didn't get, and I didn't collect. I don't know what I won. <laughs> you couldn't find your I ticket. I couldn't find my... <laughs> That's a uh, word to the wise out there. If you're listening, if you're in the raffles, hold on to your ticket so you can claim uh, your prize. You'd think they would have known what I won. Somebody. Well. I hope I mean, it wasn't something like a car. How many raffles <laughs> are going on? There's Q raffles. There's bridge raffles. There's book yeah. raffles. There's yeah. raffles for all kinds of there's stuff. Raffling off, and they're raffling off good stuff, too. Yeah, he's cutting Everybody is. He's cutting the 15 ball in the corner pocket. And he made it. And the cue ball's tracking toward the cor other corner, but no yeah, dice. Yeah, boy, this is trouble, trouble here. Uh, she doesn't have an open shot. So um, Robin's coming up saying, what do you want me to shoot, Mike? Help. You can see him having a conference <coughs> there right by the Cyclop banner before she enters the arena. She's coming into the arena for this pool table. There they are right there, strategizing. Mike has that glove. Where's the glove? And so does she. They're still strategizing. What do I do? And from what I can see, I... I can't guess at what they'll do, but I don't like this. That cue ball is going mean, to find a switch. way to that corner yeah, pocket. If she tries to cut this in, she's scratching. If she tries yeah. to make it, yeah, I mean, or if she makes it, mm -hmm. yeah, if she makes that ball, that it probably it might catch the corner and hang up, but it probably goes in the pocket. And if anybody can tell you about scratching, it would be Robert LeBlanc. Oh, stop! Well, that's because you're so knowledgeable. You see all these little. Uh, Tangent lines. Little tangent lines. There you go. See? There's those big words. What does tangent mean? I don't even know. I know what it, I know what it does. Where the ball comes off the other ball. Oh, okay. There <laughs> you go. Hello. Kerplunk. You know, I don't know much about all those different, all that technological, te technological stuff. I get down there, get over the ball, and pull the trigger. That's what I do. Well, that's see, how I play. You don't have names for a lot of the things that you do, but you do it right because it seems natural and correct to you, and you've been doing it for so long. 
but if somebody says um, you hit this ball with this English and you'll sit there and say, well, I don't know, let me see. And you get down over the ball and say, yep, that's how you do it. You know how I learned? Here's the only information I got. We're kind of talking off. But anyway, well, they, this here's what they told me. A guy named Bill Justice he used to taught me how to play banks when I was like 14. Mm -hmm. And here's all he said. He says, if you put right on the cue ball, it makes the object ball go left. And if mm -hmm. you use left, it goes right. And that was it. Right goes left and left goes right. And for the rest, for the rest, I figured it out on my own. Okay. Oh, that's all you got to know. If you know that, you sh you should. the rest should just, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? Yep. That's all you need to know. So right goes a, left and left so goes right. So there is a transfer of English when the two balls meet. And it's like a, you know, it's like a cogwheel. I've seen people argue about that forever. No, you can't transfer English to the object ball. You want to bet? Yes, you can. <laughs> Well, we're going to see here. They're going to. He's going to have to. Oh, you there's know, there's a seven ball up there. Go off two ten? balls doesn't go. No, it, it, it goes off the ten. Yeah, it's the only way. He it's can close. Make it. It's going yeah. to might go into the point. I don't think it goes straight in. I think he's got to play that seven ball in the upper left hand corner. He's got to play it off the ten. Yeah, if the ten was over like a hair to the left, it would be a hanger. You the know, four is a I would pl I would play the six ball, the five ball, and then come over to the rail. I would not do it. You can't do it from there. You're in trouble. Or oh, the one ball. I didn't see the one. I was about to say, you can't do it from there. You're in trouble. Uh, no, he's got one. a straight shot on the one. You want to give an angle on this five ball so they can come over for the ten. Because I would shoot the ten ball, uh, the seven ball, excuse me. The seven ball is right at the ten ball, so he can shoot it off the ten. Stop the cue ball and play the eight ball on the side. But you need an angle on the five to go over to that side of the table. Ideally, they leave the cue ball on the upside of that side pocket on that side or down by the nine, one or the other. But if it's down by the nine, they may not be able to cut it enough to hit the ten. So the closer to the seven ball, the better. Once That was very elaborate, ball. George. Very, I like the explanation. Did you like that? Yes, sir, I did. Took a long time. No, but it was good. It, okay. made, it uh, made sense to the people that were watching. So it made sense to you? It did. Okay, as long as it makes sense to you. I liked it. There's the angle. This is nice. This is a two-rail follow. He's going to... He's drawing the if ball. If he's drawing it, the side like pocket it. comes into play. But he got to that Boy, side. He, he did it well. It. He sure played uh, a good shot. She's got a good shot here. Play this ball off the 10. I don't think I it goes straight in. So no, and it, it might not even go off the 10. It's sitting the 10. I think it goes off the 10, but she's got to cut it. It's going to be a split hit. And that ball might keep it out of the pocket. But there'll be position on the eight ball. The other team's on the hill, right? You know what I like here? Going rail first. No, I don't. You don't like it rail first? No. It's too close to the 12. Yes. There you go with them crazy shots again. I tell you, I'm crazy as <laughs> I'm as loony as a. <laughs> you got me confused. <laughs> hey, if the ten ball was she over to the left, if she, ten, can, she can cut this ball. If the ten ball was over to the left, more. like an eighth of an inch, it'd yeah. be a hanger to make the seven. Yeah. The way it is now, it don't have to go, the way it is now. Yeah, but she's gonna give it a go because that's the only shot she has, and it's very possible. I think she's, she's gonna make it. Oh, oh, she, she missed the whole ten. She wasn't cutting it enough. Yeah, she missed the whole ten ball. And it didn't if have this, to be If that this hard. falls, yeah, she didn't. If that falls, it's a good safety. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Except for the twelve ball going in the corner pocket, straight in. So I guess all it's these not that balls good of a like this, this they, they might not get out from here with all these balls. These balls are sitting crazy. Well. If they, have if they can get out from here, they move on to the finals because they have they they're on the hill. They're going to have to do a lot of a lot of maneuvering here to run these balls. Well, I would. Start I don't think they're good. I don't think they can get out from here, George. I okay. think these balls are jammed. They are. You know, if this if the fourteen balls out here, that would simplify everything. That mm -hmm. way they could play, mm -hmm. you know. Mm -hmm. But that ball being so close, maybe. They got to shoot all the balls up in the right corner. Well, I think I would start with a little bit of. Shoot the twelve ball first in the, in the corner. Oh no! Yes, oh yes. With a and it's got it's it's lined up just where he can use a little bit of left English, and kind of get away from the eleven. He might be afraid of fudging. 
There's no fudge. It's far enough away. I would shoot the 12 ball first. Or whatever uh, whatever ball that is that's right next to the cue ball on the on the left side as you look at it right now. And that opens up those three balls that, that are <coughs> cluttered, and all three of them can be played. You'll have a choice of which one to play and go from there. Shoot the eleven. I'm shooting the eleven if I'm if I'm uh, Robin. If I'm Robin, I'm going to feel real strange. <laughs> I've, <laughs> I've never been been a woman before. Dress up like one all the time. I'm just kidding, guys. <laughs> uh, this will be a good shot. Well, she she better make this she one. If just not, a little she, bit of low English on this ball. Just a little bit of low. She's going forward. She's not going to have a shot if she goes forward. And there you go. Yep. Uh, a little bit of low English on that shot would have really opened that rack up for him. Because it would have bumped the 12 ball towards the pocket, left the cue ball where a shot was available for the 13. The high English followed it out of that little area that you needed to be in for those balls. Mike has got his hands full. The only shot I see is to cut the 12 ball down the rail. I would shoot the 13 and duck behind and hook him on the 7 and just try to come down the bottom right of the mm -hmm. table, you know. Because mm -hmm. they're shooting the 12, that's a... So just shoot the 13 into the 14 and stop the cue ball behind the 12? No, there? I'd roll down here. Oh, you come all the way down. Yeah. Just go, you'll be rolling like, sh you know. <laughs> That's what he's going to do, I think. See, but I, I think I can do everything and anything, so I would shoot the 12 and probably miss it and sell out. He's so, just like that. Good shot. That's the right shot there. Oh, this is bonus here. That's the right shot. Nice shot. Nice shot, Mike. Yeah. <clears throat> well done. Yeah, he made a good shot. Called that one, didn't you? Who? You did. Well, it was. I'm sitting right directly behind them, where he dressed the addresses the ball. See, I, I forget. I, I I I try to run out all the time, and that's why I lose so many eight ball games. And that's why I don't really play very much eight ball, especially on the seven foot table. He's going to kick this ball softly and could end up safe behind the seven. Yeah. I'll tell you one thing, that's about as good as he could do. He's doubled up. That 12 and 13 are doubled yeah. up. He's as done you can see by that perfect camera angle, Tim gives us all the camera angles we need. That's perfect. Yeah, that was a good shot he made. Mm-hmm. Now what do you do? You stop it? Or do it? Uh, well, if you just... If you put that cue ball up against the seven, they're just going to come up against it again and hook you again. I tell you, he's this. They're in, they're in a little bit of a trouble with these stripes from here. They're going to leave something to I shoot agree. at. So uh, you back cut the twelve. You cut it in the side and try to leave the cue ball. I would on, shoot the twelve the in the bottom left corner. That's cut it back. back cut it. Yeah, okay. back cut that. Okay. And then try to go two rails and stop somewhere. Up on top? I'd stop somewhere straight across from the six. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like yep. right on the yep. string. She's not, she can't execute that shot. I oh. haven't seen her well, use She's aiming English. something over here, she, but she's don't nothing. She's aiming at the combo. She's looking at the combo, and she's pointing at it. Well, this is, this is, this is a hard shot. Plus, I don't like this, because she's, if she misses this, she's probably, they're going to lose. They'll sell out. Yeah. They'll sell out. She was aiming okay to start, and then she's moved yeah. over a little bit. What she was doing there. Well, by putting that ball on the rail, she just made that uh, seven ball much more difficult. 
No, I think she was playing the, the, the 14, not the 13. As the combination. Well, she's got a tough shot here. She's got to be careful. This cue ball could come across and scratch in the upper right-hand corner. Because she can only use high English. She can't dig down. And that ball's going to travel up the line, up the table. I don't, I don't I think. I think she's going to come straight across and hit the middle diamond. Will not go forward. Boy, she hit a good two, didn't yes, she? she did. She yes, did. She did. <laughs> My God, she yes, just she rifled did. it down the good. rail. Got him a good shot. Oh, and they need man. this game. Uh, you see how good she hit it? They yeah, touched they, the rail. They need this game to tie it up. Does she know how hard that shot was? Uh, I, don't I don't think, think so. I don't think she did. That's why she made it so easy. Everybody else would have gotten nervous. Yeah, that's I wouldn't have shot, shot it. I would. That's a great shot. Well, Daryl has to make the save ball, and nice he does. Shot. They're tied at two in a race to three. Let's start over. Let's play one game for uh, $400. There I wanna, you go. This is your style. $400 a game. That's right. Get it up. I'll get it up out of the mud. <laughs> get it up out of the mud. <laughs> I just uh, one game for four hundred because the winner here moves on, and second place which is, is more important to them more than the money. They just want to keep oh, going. Oh sure, you know. Well, wouldn't you like to go back to uh, Lakewood, uh, California, and say we just won the Scotch Doubles, Silver Division, and at the national championships, or go back to Tennessee and say the same thing? These guys have fought eight or nine matches to get to this place right here. And they want to be able to play one more match. Actually, they want to be able to play two more match, two more sets to win the championship. And go back and say, we are Scotch double champions. 162 teams started out. And we're down to the last three. Loser here settles for third place and $800. The winner moves on to play the finals. There goes who, who, uh, there who goes elects the ball. who elects who to break the balls? I mean, they have to alternate they the flipped. break. It's alternate break, then they flip at the very beginning. Oh, okay. I don't think they lagged. I don't remember them lagging. I mean, but you can't like every. So every. Oh, you mean that for the team? They decide who breaks. They'll just say, "Well, you." You break would think he would have broke the ball. You know. It's up to them. Maybe he doesn't want to break all the time. She's entitled to break every once in a while. I know, but you'd think they'd want to break and scatter them out and have a chance to run out. See, you think he Because this here's a mess here. here. Well, all the balls are below. All the balls but two are below the side pockets. No matter what you take here, you can't get out. No matter here, two or three innings, you can't get out from here. That's why I say that's what's so goofy when the, it's goofy when the balls break like this. I disagree. I think if he piles that 12 ball into the 5 and makes the 9, they can get out because it opens everything up. Okay, I bet you, I bet you a dollar well, they can't, that he, don't, that he now, don't. Now they're going to go away from their trouble. <laughs> they're going to go away from all the trouble balls. And these balls are sitting this, hard. I'll tell you what. Um, he shoots a 9 here, and he might. Then it opens everything up. They can negotiate a, r a run here. Shoot the it's 9 tough, here. And awful, then awful tough. You can shoot the nine here and maybe shoot the eleven straight in the corner next. You got can the they ten. See the nine? Yeah. Can make it? Yeah. Oh. I see it. Yeah. And the ten ball goes next. But look at the fourteen, 14 ball. Fourteen doesn't right there. go. It's, fourteen it's doesn't gonna be go. Trick She's not shot. even looking at the nine ball to see if it goes. She's gonna go up there and have shape for the twelve. Oops. Well, here's, mean, here's your shot. I'm going to hit this ball so hard I'm going to jump it in the air and land it on the three ball. Meanwhile. <laughs> Crazy. I was kidding, guys. Meanwhile, you play position here for the four ball so you can come off the bottom rail and open up the two, three. If he could, if he could end, lay that cue ball right by the side pocket, uh, the same distance from the side rail as it is right now, he'd be perfect to open up the two. He's come down, and he's going to open them up. And he has the shot. They have a shot. She hits this with a lot of left English. She's going to slide over and open up those balls. 
And Kara's not afraid of get mixing it up. She's fired some shots, hasn't she? Oh, yeah. Yeah, she has. <coughs> Give it a good whack. Looks like she's doing it. Yeah. And she gave it a good whack, and she opened them up. There you go. Hello, ball. I like her style. Mm -hmm. She's fast and loose on these with these balls. You know. You know what's what's a good shot here? Shoot this soft. Come over and get position for the three ball in the upper right hand corner pocket. It's a tough shot because he's going to run into the nine ball, and it has to slide off and end up perfect. It's tough all the way around, but there's no shot up there. There's nothing up there. Nothing but heartache. Because there's a 12 ball that blocks everything. Can't even hit her solid, can she? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Well, she's going to kick it at the 3 ball and try to make the deuce. That's what I'm guessing. They're conversing. They're communicating. Yeah. Nice try. Came very close to making a good hit. Robert, what you going to do? Or should uh, I say, Bobby Cotton, what you going to do? I don't know. It's, uh, I don't know. This 12 ball has got me worried sitting over there by that ball, and it's got, like, no pocket to make except, like, one. Well, they can shoot the 12 ball first, but I what comes after I know. That? That's what I'm thinking. I don't yeah. like that either. Here's what's a shame is if that 10 went there, they could shoot that combination, mm -hmm. play position, and have something go over and knock right. that ball loose. Well, if there's nothing that goes that way. Yeah, with that 10 there, I'm not sure they can make the combination. And that's what I'm saying. Yeah, with the 10, that it won't go. Yeah. How about just playing safe? Put the ball. You know what I would do? Uh, I'd put the cue, if the cue ball could get in there. 11 and, and shoot and the 10 ball And just hit the 10, out. just yeah, roll it. Stop the cue ball. Right there. There you go. And get that's rid of that mess. Ask. I wonder if that will go. The um, problem is that that 2-3 might go to the side pocket. But maybe Freddie, does the 3 ball go? Two two three combo. Uh, you see that two and three right next to the eight ball? I think it, he's going to play safe. It looks like it goes to that uh, side pocket. I don't know what he's doing. Freddie says they're not frozen, so there's probably no chance of them going. He's playing the, I guess he's playing the 15 ball. Might not go. Ball, the 11 ball. It went. And now the only shot they have now is. Oh, I know. There's no doubt what to do here. Yeah, break the 9, hit the 9, and slide over by slide the 14. Slide off the 10. Yeah. Slide off the 10. Put them, get them right yep. behind the 14. You know? Yep. And just uh, use the 14 to block the three solids that are kind of grouped together. <coughs> Here comes Robin. Robin Brumby from Lakewood, California. She's going off the 10. I like it. Plays out of Lakewood and Billiards. Now. Is there another conference? Another conference. And there's your safety. These balls are still sitting kind of weird. 
even if they get a ball in hand, mm -hmm. unless, he, unless he moves his oh, six. Oh, yeah. yeah that's, well, with ball in hand, they, cush, they could run out. There's one thing for certain. they got to get these three balls off before they do anything else. Because if they start trying to, you know what I'm saying? Yes. If they try to play position coming down, this, this is a mess. You're talking about the three balls at the, at the on the bottom rail. Yeah, they got to get rid of those. The I think he can hit the six. Yeah, he's hitting the six. Look at that. Pretty good shot there. Yep. And I think Robin will pot, I mean, Mike will pocket that uh, 12 ball. Stop it there for the 15. And see if uh, Robin can get in position to come on the, any of these three balls down here. Where did Natalie leave her straight in? Yeah, he's, go he's going to look. So oh, he didn't. He gave no, her, nice he shot. Gave her an it's angle. It's still tough. He worked hard for that angle. And she shoots easy, too. She's going to be, she likes to shoot easy. Does she? So yeah. it's going to be tough for her to get back down here. Now watch her come out with one of them Shane Man Boeing strokes <laughs> and go like spin down here two rails. Back she up. just draw it back two rails. Yeah. yeah. Draw it back three rails and get perfect on the yeah. nine or the 14. Yeah, yeah I can see it. <laughs> Let's see if she shoots it hard. No, she likes to oh shoot. Oh, my. He's ducking off the 14. Uh, yes, he is. He's going to come down here. That cue ball is probably going to end up right uh, up against the nine. She got the, she's got the delicate touch. Mm-hmm. I think I don't know what he's going to do here. He's trying Just, to. Just don't double kiss this. He's ball. trying to get behind those ten yeah, nine, is. but it's hard. Yeah, uh, the speed has to be good. And oh, it's it good. It is good. It's perfect. Oh, no. he, it leaked out. Oh, it leaked out. Well, the six goes in the two. See if they can. The six, the two, and they got to get shape on that three. Well, she's got to get it back a little bit for the two. I bet she just rifles a six in. <laughs> She's been doing it. Draws it back about four inches mm -hmm. and be straight in on the two. There she goes. Ponytail and all. This is this one game for the cookies here, guys. If you're running off to the fridge to get to, to get something out of the fridge, you better huh. hold on. <laughs> all right. She's a tall drink of water. She's pretty. Robert. What? Well, that's nothing wrong with that. She's a pretty lady. It's, I enjoy watching pretty ladies play pool. Yes. Nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with that at all. Something wrong with that? Just go ahead and shoot me. <laughs> Just go ahead and shoot <laughs> Get me out of my misery. <laughs> um. I love women that play pool. Mm -hmm. Look her. She's got a good stroke, too. I mean, she yeah. gets over the ball. Look at. I'm telling you, look at this shot. You think she didn't... She, he drew, shot the ball in, the ball split the pocket, and yeah. drew the ball too much. Yep. A little too much. She Actually, hit the ball this good. This is going to work out pretty good. I'll tell you something. She, with a little bit of coaching, she could be a, a real good She's player, got a real player. fluid stroke. Yeah. Yep. You watch her stroke in the queue. I mean, she's got a powerful stroke. And her, her mechanics are good, too. Yeah. She, uh, she lines up on the ball good. Yeah. I mean, she's uh, over the she ball. She strokes the ball. She's not afraid to turn it loose. Either. No. She's right over the ball. I'd go ahead and run on. Look at this shot. This is, come on down. Oh, boy. Let's see if she fires this one in. <laughs> he keeps putting the heat on her. She's coming up with all the trick shots. She's having to make all the circus shots. She's getting <laughs> him in position. She keeps getting him in position. He keeps getting her out of line. Yeah. You know, well, here she goes. Well, I tell you, she shoots really good for a 436 okay. Fargo. Nice soft, nice and soft. And just roll, bear. Oh, roll. and she hit it good. No, 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 no. Oh boy, you think she didn't hit that ball good? <laughs> that was a nice shot. Tell me and about she, it. And that was for that was uh, for the money, money there, buddy. That's for the cash there. Sweet, you might have missed a shot that ball right to the rail. <laughs> Probably. You know, dog, the way I dog, dog my it. brains oh, out. Yeah. Me too. Yep. She Watch. hit that ball good. Make sure he makes it. Made it. That's it. Wow. They move on to the finals, Mike, uh, Mike and uh, Robin. Uh, 
Settled for third place and 800 bucks. She played good. I'll tell you something. She won that match for him.